Hey Cowgirl, in this video I'm doing a how to tuck up English style. So if you haven't seen my western version of this, it's linked up here, I think. Um, yeah, also please subscribe, turn your notifications on, please go join my Roblox group called Western for Life. It's linked in the channel description. <laughs> um, yeah, and also please go check out my sister's channel, Athena Cowgirl, it's spelled there, it's also linked right here. Um, yeah. So let's get into this video. All right, so I've already brushed Trinket down to make sure she doesn't get any saddle sores or get irritated by anything. So first thing I'm gonna do, this is optional, but it's a riser pad. And if you um, <laughs> look inside, if you can get them open, um, it's got these pads, which just, the reason we have it for Trinket is not because she's got a sore back, it's, got this grippy pad under because obviously large tummy and we don't want the saddle sliding sideways which has happened to me before so yeah trying to prevent that <laughs> you want it to be about right here roughly and actually what I didn't do before is take out these back pads because we just need the front ones on trinket so I'm just gonna take these out real quick Mm, I have to put them somewhere so they don't blow away. Under here, I suppose. Alright. Gotta make sure that it's like that. And then you're gonna get your other saddle pad. It's quite big for Trinket because it's a big horse saddle pad. Since I don't actually ride English, but I have done English before. I used to ride English like three years ago. There we go. Grab my... Now you're gonna get your saddle. Your saddle pad should look like about like that. And you're gonna get your saddle on. Like that. And then what I just like to do is just grab the saddle pad and just pull it up. And both of them up like that. So it should look a bit like that. And then just make sure your girth straps aren't tangled up. <laughs> and then what you're going to do is come over to this side. And again, make sure your girth straps aren't tightened, aren't twisted, not tightened. And then have it about here. Again, I like to have my saddle pad, saddle girth back a bit from normal people because she gets roly poly. <laughs> and then what you're going to do is grab your girth. Trinket's puffing again. Tighten it, make sure you get the <laughs> coat out. Trinket's got a fluffy winter coat right now. So, you know, just a fluffy. There we go. Should look a bit like this. Gonna go for a walk. Trinket's kind of mad for walking because she likes to keep puffing and she can't walk and puff her belly out at the same time. And then what you're going to do is tighten your girth up again. And it'll look a bit like that. Should look pretty similar. Alright, so if you're wondering how to adjust stirrups, here's how. So your stirrups would be like this, right? You take this out of here and then you just grab all of that and then you just pull your stirrup down to like normal length. I'm not sure, sure whose stirrup length that is right now, but do the mine or Becky's. Pull this. Okay, so if you are, say, hole three, you go up to number hole three, so one, two, three, number three. And then just pull it back through like that. And then do that and your stirrups are adjusted. And these stirrups are a different color from the saddle. It's because 
these stirrups are from a different saddle. <laughs> and the stirrup, the saddle did not come with stirrups. So had to make sure for what we had. <laughs> and yeah, you do the same on the other side. Okay, so once you've got your girth all nice and tight, um, I like to stretch their legs so that their skin doesn't get all folded underneath and they're less likely to get saddle sores from this. So what you're gonna do is pick up their foot, like you're gonna pick it with a hoof pick and then just gonna stretch it forward. And some horses will actually develop how they like this because it's a stretch for them. And then do it on both sides. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope it helped you guys tack up. So, bye!